Welcome and hello. Today we're taking a look at an Android phone. Uh, if I'm pronouncing it right, it's called the x Um This is an unlocked Android uh, cell phone. This works with uh, AT&T and compatible services. Let's take a look at it. The main reason I want to show you this is, you know, most phones today, or a lot of phones, if you go to buy them outright, um, they can be six, seven, eight hundred dollars, as much as a thousand dollars for like the new iPhone, uh, nine hundred dollars for the newest Samsung phones. Um, and for most people, they don't need that kind of power. Uh, this phone goes for about hundred and fifty dollars, sometimes less, and um, can do what most people need quite easily. So we have the phone here. We're gonna take a look at the phone. Let's take a look at a few other things that it comes with, because you really get a lot with this kit. Um, you do get a charging cable. All right, you got uh, your adapter. That is a SIM card remover over here for placing the SIMs on here. And we'll talk a lot about the specs afterwards. We have um, a 16 gigabyte SD card, which is included with this. All right, and you can put a larger one in. We're gonna leave that on the side for now. And over here, you're gonna see that the phone actually comes with a hard, uh, this feels like a glass screen protector on here. Okay, so you can place that on to protect your screen. You get a carrying case with it. All right, pretty nice little clear protective case. This is a silicone case. All right, so protect your phone as well. Very nice. And you got your manual. Although it is Android, so for the most part, Android is Android, but there's some you know specifics in here. So let's move this aside and take a look at the phone itself right now. Package nice. You actually have a screen protector on here already. All right. Take off some of this new packaging material that it comes with. Oh, I didn't do that too good a job with that, but we'll take that off afterwards a little better. All right. So it's got some protective screening on it. I'm going to leave that on for now. It tells you here your headphone jack is over here. So you can see that. All right. Your SIM card, uh, dual SIM cards are on the side here. You can remove them using the SIM card removal tool. You have your cameras, fingerprint sensor, power button, volume button. All right. In the bottom, you have a reset button over here, which is nice to have. You have a mic. Your microphone's down here. You have your USB, micro USB charging, and you have a dual little speaker system over there. All right. So let's go ahead and turn this guy on. We can peel this screen protector off. All right, phone's booting up. Android is starting. All right, you got a background on there. You can swipe, and you're in. You're up and running. Um, beautiful quality image on there. All right, very nice screen. Screen's looking very good on here. Standard Android, battery power, everything else on there. Swipe down, notifications, Wi-Fi settings. Let's go ahead and connect it to our Wi-Fi here. Okay, Wi-Fi is connected. You have your standard apps. Uh, it'll come preset up with some things, nice things on it. You have an FM radio built in. You have your camera. Let's take a look at the camera. Right. We'll give you all the specs on it, but uh, it's a 13 megapixel rear camera, as you can see. And you can't see that by my hand, but it's a 13 megapixel rear camera, a 5 megapixel front facing or selfie camera. Right. Quick on the, on the photos. Right. Jump into the photos app. Of course, I took some while moving it. Um, you can share them, Bluetooth, so forth, all the normal things. Go back to the main screen. Your gallery is where we just were, where you can see the pictures you took today. And you can see the speed on here is pretty responsive. So if I say gallery, pictures, pictures, it's very responsive, very nice speed. Um, again, you know, for most people, this is more than they'd need and no reason to spend the kind of money uh, today that people do. Uh, this is a wonderful, great Android phone if you're on the AT&T or uh, compatible networks calculator. You have your phone, contacts, apps. You can add in your Gmail account by simply going down, going into the settings. All right. 
And you can see this is your standard Android menu here. You can go to accounts. You can add an account. I'm going to add a Gmail account in. But as you see, unlike a lot of phones from carriers that are locked and they require you to do certain things as soon as you turn on the phone, this doesn't require you to do anything. It's an unlocked phone. You turn it on and you're in. The phone's working. And then you can go and add the accounts and whatever you want later. I'm going to add a test account that I have in here. All right, Android, you agree? It confirms everything. All right. You can see it's already downloading some updates here from the Google Play Store. And there you go. Once that's done, uh, you have the option of going into the Google Play Store, downloading more apps. Uh, you can update your online apps. You can do everything you need to do now, now that you have a Google account in there. All right, you go into settings. You have all your configuration things that you would have in Android, from setting up your Wi-Fi, your Bluetooth, SIM cards, data usage, uh, everything. You can go to the Play Store, and it does include the Google Play Store. Some You'll find some third-party phones do not include the Play Store uh, by default because they don't conform to Google standards. All right. I'm going to update on here. It's got to update the Play Store. All right, and then we're up to date. Now we can go in here and check for the apps that are currently on the phone, and we can update them. While it's checking for updates, let's go over some of the specs that you get on the phone. So this is the Xgodi D22 Unlocked Dual SIM cell phone. It comes with Android 7.0. It's a 5.5 inch 4G FDD LTE quad core. Has 32 gigs of RAM out of the box, 16 gigabytes of ROM and 16 gigabyte on the SD card. Two gigabytes of RAM with a fingerprint sensor on the back. It's a 13 megapixel back camera with a five megapixel front camera. It works on AT&T and T-Mobile. Screen resolution is 720 by 1280 HD. It has GPS, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, built-in sensors for directional sensor, proximity sensor, light sensor, distance sensor, acceleration sensor. Obviously, you can do MMS, SMS, email, Gmail. You have a three and a half inch headphone jack, uh, which a lot of people don't you know, want, but a lot of phones don't have anymore. It uses a micro USB for charging and for connecting to your computer. It has Smart Work, Wake, the Play Store, all the standard built-in apps. It comes with a 2800 milliamp hour high quality lithium ion battery. Gives you about 50 to 60 hours of standby time, about 8 to 10 hours of talk time. It weighs 195 grams with the battery. And the physical dimensions are 154 millimeters by 76 by 8.7 millimeters or 6.08 inches by 3 inches by 0.34 inches. And I'm very impressed with the display on here. It's not going to come through on here, but it's a very, very nice uh, screen on here. Very nice quality. Looks really good. Still have your headphone jack, which a lot of people miss. Um, got all your ports in the bottom. The thickness of the phone, it's a nice phone. It feels very solid. Uh, does not feel at all like a cheap phone. It really feels like a nice, well-made phone on here. Uh, audio quality, everything on it seems to be really nice. Let's pull up something on here. We have no music on here at the moment, so let's go ahead and uh, pull up something else. Let's install YouTube. Let's find something on here. I don't want to play too much because this video could get taken down. Here we are doing a photo shoot in London. Doing background things for the 
lyrics for the magazine. It's painting about my feelings. This is amazing. Two exclusive magazines, each with the full album. Are you ready for it? Only a Target. Okay, so a really nice screen, really impressed with the quality of the screen, I really like the feel of the phone. Um, it's amazing today what you can get for the price. Uh, you know, for around $150, this is an excellent choice phone, I feel. Um, it does, you know, comes with everything you need, screen protectors, case, silicone case. Uh, it feels really good. Camera does a decent job. Um, everything about it is very nice. So I'll put a link below to where you can find it. Uh, remember, this does only work on AT&T and, uh, AT and T-Mobile. And uh, if you have any questions, put them below, and I'll do my best to answer them or redirect you to where you can get your answers. Thank you very much for watching.